seeing their ways. Welcome, good day, and hello to Silent Time, the opportunity to think on what is really important in life. As humans, we can only see some part of another person. We might see what they do, how they behave, but we do not know all the background. We do not know their real intentions. We do not know all of their history, their thoughts and everything. God knows everything. He knows the ways of everybody. Sometimes it might appear that someone does a lot of good things. Maybe in the heart there is still a lot of evil or the other way around. By the time of Isaiah, God had been angry with the people because they had acted in sin and greed. They were stubborn and kept on their own ways. And yet he says, Isaiah 57 verse 18, I have seen how they acted, but I will heal them. I will lead them and help them, and I will comfort those who mourn. I offer peace to all, both near and far. I will heal my people. God knows how we are, and yet he offers healing. He offers help. He offers peace and comfort. And he already has done it, because the biggest Enemies, the biggest darkness that makes our hearts dark, they are already overcome. Sin and temptation, devil and death and hell, they are all defeated. Jesus has won the victory. And he said, those who are well have no need of a physician, but those who are sick. He has come to call not the righteous but sinners, Mark 2 verse 17. God knows how we are, God knows how how sick we are, how evil we are, even the things we hide, maybe we even don't know them ourselves, the bad sides of us. God knows everything. And yet, he wants to heal us, to comfort us. Lord, we thank you for that great love, for that help that you bring. You are the good shepherd. You see our ways. You see everybody's ways. You know every thought. You know our real intentions, and yet you want to help us, you want to change us, you want to make us suitable to fit into your kingdom, where your holiness reigns. As we are, we do not fit in, but you want to change us, and we pray that you send your Holy Spirit to change us, to make us fit and suitable. All praise be to you. And we pray that you also take away all the other negative sides, all darkness and fear, and that you prepare us and make us as you want us to be. Praise and glory and honor be to you forever. Amen.